Newsbeat. This week's Earth Positive News, brought to you by Made by Planet. This is Biki, your host, bringing you happy news from across the globe. So friends, stay tuned. First up, the rewilding of Zinove National Park in East Africa is a roaring success. After facing many challenges, the park is coming back to life. The park had to close because of a big war, and many animals disappeared. Animals like elephants and zebras were successfully reintroduced. To their surprise, the cameras found a strong male lion. Recently, they even saw a lioness with cubs. This is a good sign as more lions will come back to the park. Zinove National Park will be home to many more animals once again. Next, we have some great news about one-horned rhinos in India. These majestic animals are the biggest and strongest of rhino species. But their numbers went down due to poaching. A special project called Project Rhino, also known as Indian Rhino Vision 2020, was started in 2005 with an aim to save this wonderful animal from extinction. The Department of Environment and Forests of the Government of Assam worked on this project, along with many other organizations like WWF India, IFAW, and the International Rhino Foundation. And guess what? It worked! The number of rhinos has increased by 167% since the 1980s. Project Rhino has become one of the biggest wildlife conservation success stories. Let's all head to the mountains of Kyrgyzstan, a country where snow leopards live. Snow leopards are magnificent big cats that live in the snowy mountains and have beautiful white and gray fur with special spots. These beautiful animals are facing many challenges like climate change, mining, and conflicts with local herders. To help the herders and the snow leopards, two conservation groups, Snow Leopard Trust and Snow Leopard Foundation in Kyrgyzstan have started a special program. They are teaching the herders new skills like beekeeping. The herders get beehives and training to take care of the bees. This provides alternate means of livelihood to the herders and reduces conflict with snow leopards. Now, for some exciting news from London. Beavers are coming back after more than 400 years. Long ago, people used to hunt them and they disappeared. But now, they are being reintroduced. Beavers are amazing because they can change the environment in a good way. They built dams with wood, which help create homes for other animals. Insects live there, and that brings fish and birds. These dams also help slow down water flow and make wetlands and meadows. These dams actually help prevent floods. Beavers are nature's superheroes, making a positive impact on environment. Up next... Let's fly to Spain to meet this week's eco-warrior, 16-year-old Olivia Mandel. Olivia is no ordinary girl. She is an EU Climate Pact ambassador, a National Geographic storyteller, and even a marine ambassador for the Wild Foundation. In 2019, she invented a fantastic tool called the Jelly Cleaner that helps remove microplastics from the sea made from ordinary recycled materials like ballet tights and plastic bottles. And when she learned about dolphins trapped in the Barcelona Zoo, she started a powerful campaign to save them. Today, the campaign has already gathered over 154,000 signatures on change.org and is actively working with politicians in the Spanish Congress to enact legislation. She has received an international award from the Jane Goodall Institute Global for her amazing campaigns. Olivia believes that our oceans are vital for life, and she dreams of creating a special place called SUA, Save Us All, a marine sanctuary in the Mediterranean. With her determination, Olivia is making a difference in showing us that anyone can be a hero for animals and our planet. For more information about her work, visit www.oliviamandel.com. Before I sign off, 
Friends, here are some of the best art imaginations received last week. So, if you have positive art creations on our planet Earth, send them to me on the details given in the description below and I would love to feature them. Until next time. Happy Earth, Happy Children.